Whatever life you were living before, forget it. You need to live for the Lord Jesus. Stop daydreaming. You need to live for the Lord Jesus. And don't expect things will become better in the world. The world is from bad to worse, to the worst of all. The world has always been in decline. There will never goodness come out of the world because the world is placed in the bosom of Satan. Nothing good comes out of the evil one. Only goodness comes from the good God, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My beloved, we need to choose who shall we live for. Are we going to live for the light of the world, Christ? Or are we going to live for the filth of the world, Satan? You need to make that choice. Stop doing the wrong things under the sun. Stop going to places the Lord disapproves of. My son, my daughter, I beg of you, do not do anything the Lord dislikes or disapproves. Be you. Don't ever pretend to be someone God had not created you to be. God wants you. You better come to Him as you. Don't fake it. Don't put a mask on. Don't act. Come as you are. You're a sinner, you're filthy, you're dirty, you're this, you're that. Come as you are. Jesus is capable to cleanse you from every, every sin, from every foul deed. He is waiting because the time of grace is still on. It is hanging on by a thread. Believe me. Believe me. The Lord will burn this world with fire because humanity have sinned beyond measures. The 21st century has surpassed both Sodom and Gomorrah and the time of Noah. We have surpassed both of them. Sodom and Gomorrah, LGBTQSYZ. Noah, divorces. Today, both are happening at a full steam ahead. I can't say to my son, you're a boy. And I will barbecue you. I will call him son, he is a boy. And, and, and if it's a girl, I'll say, this is a girl, it's a female. I will call that till the day the Lord calls me home. I will call that. Who do you think you are to tell me what to say and what to believe in? Jesus lives forever. I live in him too. No one, no one changes what Jesus had taught me. No one.